I'm back here in this little area I was calling the in my gem ravine where I noticed a lot of probably does have been bedding down. Been a couple days now. A little bit of fresh snow, just to get an idea. idea where does like the bed. I'm going to take you on a little tour here of the upper part of my gem ravine. I'm going to stick in a few still shots in here and show you what this area looked like as I move along. What the area looked like prior to me doing my work in here. Give you some ideas of some of the changes. That I did to make this area such a desired spot for deer. Number one thing I did, as you see from the still photos, is I removed all those nasty autumn olives. Now it's all a bunch of deer crap. More autumn olive destruction. Of course I did like everything else. I come in and I thin these cedars out. that took out all the invasives, made it a little more desirable, opened areas up. The other thing is in an area like this, deer browse these cedar trees. You now you walk over a spot like this right here, ground is just covered with deer poop. This is where I shot my little introduction video the other day. And what I did in here to make this a nice little deer bedding area is, other than removed all the crap, I limbed down these cedars. Make it so deer could come through here. I also thin the cedars out. The camera location, trail camera that you're going to see some pictures of was sitting right over there.
give you some good before and after shots this area right here give you an idea the kind of work I do to open things up to make it so deer could travel through bring sunlight to the ground make browse and make deer habitat in general.